It is time for another episode of Old Man Yells at Cloud. Today, with a special guest, the Swiss Focus 3. <laughs> when this Focus 3 came out, there was a theory that the Swiss Focus 3 was outsourced to someone, not to the usual dev team. And I could buy it because this Focus 3 really just, it's like a Kaiserreich Focus 3, you know? It's not, oh yeah, over here I do my navy and then my air and my army. Every Focus 3 is structured and then this one is just bleh. Anyway, uh, we do have a lot of choice with our first focus, so let us start with the Swiss guiding principles. I don't think anybody expected that one. And then, because we are Switzerland and we have factories, we shall build factory so we have more factory. Less than 80% for federal assembly, but also less than... That is my biggest gripe with the Swiss focus tree. If you thought Bulgaria was confusing with its three different factions and then everybody's just trying to shoot you, Switzerland is not the same, but you can legitimately brick yourself. Depending on which advices you get and which focuses you take and in which order you do, you can just brick and then never even be able to to do your focus tree, which is so weird. Like no other country has this. Like you can't do any, <laughs> anyway, I, I think I can figure this out. Fuck, which side? I'm just gonna click this one. I'm just gonna pretend this is Kaiserreich and I'm gonna click decisions even though I don't know which one is gonna do which. All right, these are all the same buffs. We can just decide which one do we no longer want. Okay, these are pretty much the same. So let's get rid of Baumann. I guess the Social Democrat is pretty good. Oh, the Socialist Pacifist though. Yeah, let's just pump out some PP. We can reaffirm spiritual defense. So the Swiss focus tree, especially early on, is just a lot of waiting because you're playing Switzerland. Let's fortify the border with Germany. Germany, actually. I have plan today. I have very good plan. Much plan. All the plan. And then we can take a look at our god. No, we don't have command power because we don't have war support. 0.02 a day. Uh, Ban Nazi propaganda. For Nazi propaganda at least. Let's go for Buroha. Could go up to free trade. We don't really have resources anyway, so might as well get the bonus research speed. Don't need to boost anything because we have fixed our fascist problem. In a little bit, it will no longer be a fascist problem because then it's gonna be a fascist solution. Okay, now we need to be to the left of the strong thing. Gotthard Bund, let's go. Now we need less than 15% for the fascists. Ah, okay. That's that's what happens when you don't play Switzerland for a little while. You forget that it has stupid mechanics. For example, a counselor that's not a counselor. And then we're gonna get Fugger, the Adolf. What? What? <laughs> How did that? Paradox. It cost me 112. You can see, currently in the council, minus 25% because of strong council control. It cost me 150. I don't want to keep yelling at clouds, man. <sighs> Paradox, 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 paradox. With PP gain, please. Oh, yeah, the human. Maya, we hired Maya after firing Maya. Austria rejected us, okay, fair enough. Let us do the time walk again. I can't believe that Switzerland is not one of the highlighted countries, man. This is truly injustice. Anyway, let's do all of this again, but this time with strategy. Trial shall continue. I don't know why it took Germany so long to do anything about it. Ooh, ah, mmm. Okay, wait a minute. We should be good. There we go. Then we are at 80, minus 80 for Germany, which does mean they cannot declare war on us just yet. Oh, can I get a third Maya? Uh, but we don't have one. Mm. Yeah, let's just get Fogo. Wait, no, 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 wait, 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 to the left, okay, to the left. We are all good over here, my friends. Okay, now we need less than 80% democratic. Oh, ah, let, let's restart, come on. It's been like 10 minutes. I do not like the Swiss focus tree. The great thing is the career profile will be like, oh, you must really like Switzerland. You've played it 20 times already. No, I made two Switzerland runs. I seriously wish the Swiss focus tree wouldn't be so clunky and there were more paths. It could just be such a cool focus tree. Just imagine you're playing a Switzerland. Ew. You have to juggle the different powers around you. Help the allies with like espionage and such, which yeah, there's a tree here. Something actual. I will say doing that in Hearts of Iron would be pretty hard. Right now, Hearts of Iron only has war. You can't really make the argument that 
industry as a thing apart from the war every mechanic is just too shallow to really to really give a country like switzerland something that's actually interesting to do here which is sad also why is the focus tree always jumping to the right what hispano aviacion why this is so random that it seems intentional stuff like this is super interesting honestly paradox where did you get this from chill brother oi once again get the vikings in power and now we can't get that's exactly what I dislike about this focus tree. You really need to plan every single thing out. I will have to cancel this, else we can't get Pro Helvetia, which I really want. 15% PP and 5% consumer goods. So wait a minute. Germany is at 70. Let's get one of these going again. Okay, now we can focus on internal matters. And by that I mean we can press for Vorarlberg. I'm actually gonna improve relations with France. Try and open banks with France. Swiss gold trade, yeah. Yes, and now we should be at minus 80, and this is gonna jump up again. Okay, I'm also gonna push for centralization once. Come on, let's do it. Yes, we can preempt Anschluss. This focus tree is very easy to go. To, to go? Guga, help please. Is anybody there? I've been talking to myself for nine months now. Is there nobody here? We. Ost Switzerland, we are now. I never switched to free trade. Uh, this game is ruined. The democratic support is slowly falling. Then we can make some concessions to the Germans, I suppose. It shouldn't bump us that much, but it can just decrease our Swiss gameplay time. Where we just watch this number go lower until this one is a nice shade of gray. There we go. We shall first go for the French Alps because the French still like us. Now we can get the Italian Alps, improve relations a little bit. I'm just going to appease Italy. And now we actually can build some convoys. Woo! Convoys, Merlin, convoys. This is so weird. We need less than 50% democratic support here and then we need more than 50. If we want to make a coup, why? Go lower, come on, you can do it can just keep on pissing off Germany and if you do this all quickly enough then you can call in Italy against Germany which is a strat that I really enjoy right focus tree I forgot about that one we get calls on everything now and now we need less than 40 percent su democratic support to bring democracy back to Germany <laughs> You get claims on all of Italy, all of France and all of Germany here. There we go, we have calls, we have resources, we have a cool new flag. And now we can just sit around and play Dungeons and Dragons and piss Germany off. Damn it! Germany does not like us. I'm actually going to pull my army back from the front. If we're lucky, the tiger will pounce right into the trap. Oh god, we have factories now. Ah, shit. Italy joined Germany. Okay. In that case, I will just try and do this here. Improve some relations and appease the Germans. If I was quicker here, we could have called in Italy against Germany and then it's just such a quick and easy war. It's just so fun because then it's just Germany. And then because you are on the front with all of your mountains, they will just grind up against you. And then once you have reformed your army, you can then counterattack. Ah, oh, fuck. I should have done this one. Like, there's so much... <sighs> there's so much to do in this focus tree. My main problem with this is just it's so confusing. Oh, actually, now we can... Oh, God, I'm not gonna take these. I shall edit this one. This one is actually pretty good. Infantry template 4, my favorite number. The rest we can just dismiss. Cannot train new special division template? What? Ah, those were Austrian divisions and I can't create those for some reason. Okay, all of you switch to the infantry template 4. Could be much worse. Let's get Soviet steel. So for higher quality than the non-existent French steel. Artillery export, infantry specialist. Thank the Sano. I do not care about Turkey. Seriously, one of those days I will disable the Bosporus Battle Royale DLC. Because I just can't see this event anymore. Oh god, I have not researched bombs yet. <laughs> Every single time it just happens. I guess we're not getting any elections anymore, huh? Should have ended on somebody else then. Finland actually accepted the Soviet... Dem that's not... That's kind of a dick move. They accepted the demands and you still declared war on them. Tanks or... Tanks. 
but this one gives us more army XP, so we will get the multi-purpose tanks. And then very early cannons too, although that locks us out of a research slot for a long time. Let's just make a front here as well. Oh fuck, I forgot about Hungary. We are surrounded everywhere by enemies. The true Switzerland experience. We have 100 factories in Switzerland in 1940. <laughs> It's ridiculous. I sure wish I had a different guy though. Fuck Yugoslavia. That's gonna open another front. I'm actually going to join the allies. Not join the war just yet. We can't do worker rights things. Oh wait, limited censorship of the press. Yes, minus 10% democratic. And now uh, let us produce a uh, de-bomber. The big boy, the strong boy, the attacker, the conqueror of the worlds. Okay, that, that plane actually kind of sucked. We have two big gun. So this one doesn't have any range and no air defense. Uh, whatever, we have manpower, I guess. There we go, I'm just going to dump these as port divisions because I am a responsible adult that always listens to his own advice. Mostly because I have already played Switzerland for two hours at this point and I don't want this run to end by a naval invasion. Yes, we can protect France now. Barbarossa started. Okay, the US joined the allies. I think that is our call as well. And with our call, I mean I will make uh, just a small save here. Then we shall join the war and immediately get pummeled because all of our divisions are out of position. Actually, that wasn't that bad. That repositioning was pretty good. What about those planes that we have? We could use them. Yeah, I'm a little bit scared because we don't have that many. We need allied planes here. Screw garrisons for now. You're gonna go over here. Then we can dump you out and just turn you into garrison divisions. If they keep on pushing on the Hungarian border, they will just overrun us. Yeah, that's a lot of pushing. I sure wish I had flame tanks right now. Romania? Oh god, the Soviets! They had a plan and they sure executed on it. Uh, we also have the allies helping out on this one port in Nice. Le Nice, as they say in France. God damn, we're losing planes fast. Okay, War Bonds doesn't do anything. We have minus 9% right now, so War Bonds legitimately does not do anything for us. Hmm. The Germans are just sitting around on the front. They're really not pushing. Just make a small poke here. Yo, but the Soviets, they are really angry. They are prepared. But then let's just make a push with these guys. At least secure Italy. 4.6 million against 2 million. And they're just getting thrashed by the Soviets for once. Finally, coup time. Honestly, with these divisions. Let's just make a front line here. Vichy France joined the Axis. That is bad. Italy still hasn't... No, no, no Italian civil war. What have you done, Mussolini? Seriously, what is your trick? Finally, we can get some flame tanks going. After we almost capitulated Italy. I will just hope that the Axis does not reinvade here. That would be ungood. Yeah, just look at that. We're just pushing into Germany. Mussolini has been deposed. Finally, it flipped to the UK. I can't get over to Palermo. Thank you very much. Even though we do have 100% naval superiority. Paradox. What? Oh, we own... Co why do we have Corsica? The following states will be transferred to... Yay! Cool! Look at that! We have the guy! But we still can't make him a commander. Because why would we? He's only our field marshal and our guy. Now we're done with the left side of the focus tree and... Interestingly enough, we can now transition to the right side. Literally. Germany is gone. Actually, pretty decent points. Would have liked to get all of Italy. But I mean, 800 points versus... 700 for the UK and 1.5 from the Soviets. Could be much worse. That's not a lot of German boats left. Then we can get Italy. We're gonna keep the German cores. We couldn't pop them, so we had to do it like this. Yeah, we kind of fucked up here, didn't we? <gasps> we have a railway gun. The Eisenbahn battery is 690. Where is it? Yes, the Raj wants to give me 100,000 men. Thank you. Military exercises with our fascist neighbor, Japan. The neighbor relationship between Switzerland and Japan has always been underestimated in World War II. It is disgusting how it's never been mentioned. I don't want to dally anymore. Declare war on Germany. I could fight without the UK, but uh, manpower. Oh god, we can't get women in the workforce now. Because we don't have stab. All adult serve it is then. Poland with the counterattack from behind. They're not encircled because of a Rostock, but they will be encircled. I have foreseen it. Oh, I made the co 
I made the wrong front line. That's why it's so scuffed. France got an event that the, we are planning against them. But that's not really a plan. That's just, oh yeah, we are at war. I guess we can do war things while we're at war. Japan would get the fascist puppet event, man. Request French occupation. Japan gets event. Alpine Confederation requests expansion of their territories. Every own state gets another two land forts. Guess that's one way to complete the Siegfried line. Just everything is part of the Siegfried line now. Woo, that's a lot of green. We don't have manpower, but that's a lot of green. I guess we need to stop a little bit here. It's red and now we just need to wait. At this point, we're already used to waiting because we've played through the Swiss Focus Tree. So now we can also just wait until the Swiss Focus Tree has been completed. Just like the Siegfried line. What the fuck? Those are the eight great powers. China, Ethiopia, Poland. Okay, China is definitely not a major. No, please don't lose this. I read. When does that happen? 100 Soviet divisions. Even I have more than that and I'm not a DAI. France has almost more than that. Okay, France officially has more than that now. Yo, Italy! I always love how the Italian AI is just so hell-bent on taking Vladivostok. 43% war score? From what? We did 2 million damn- How? When? I mean, there were a lot of pockets, but okay. Fuck, man, what are we gonna do now? Let's just get Balkong. And the rest of the party can just do this. Germany at war again. A little bit late for that, I think. It's a little bit late for Germany to be at war again. And the Swiss Swarm is attacking at this point. The war is won. Yeah. Swiss Focus Tree. No. 